Red Sox, the Patriots, now the Bruins. What a time to be a Boston sports fan. They go for this city's third team title in just over seven months. As for the Blues, this is the city they played their last Stanley Cup final game in 49 years ago. Game one of the Stanley Cup final, the Boston Bruins against the St. Louis Blues. Spiked along to the corner and nicely lifted back out again by Charlie Coyle. Coming along for it is Johansson able to gain the line and fire it across and a shot right on goal was stopped there by Bennington. Oh, the left pad came up large. Tarasenko taken out of the play by the captain Zdeno Chara, but then it's held by Shen. Shen fired one, kicked back out again by Rask. Rebound bounced on back. Shen a shot. He scores! One to nothing in favor of the Blues on Braden Shen's goal. He scored in game six, and here he gets the icebreaker in game one of the Stanley Cup final. And Bo Meester with a great stick on stick play. Luigi able to hand it across, escaping now, Johansson around, hit the post with a shot, pile a shot, and that bounced off of the defense of Gunnarsson. Oh my goodness. Blues leading 1-0, one, one minute gone by, in the second in front, Tarasenko shoots, he scores! Tarasenko, and the blow is a minute into the second, have taken a 2-0 lead. A quick little snap, one-timer, and again, it's going to be that low blocker area Then he beats Tuka Rask for the second goal of the game here for this top line. But he was defended away. Bruins accelerate ahead. It's brought on by Corrali. Corrali moves up with a Chari. Hold. Big one in front. Oh, score! Off of Bennington. Tipped in. And it is two to one. Clifton collects the goal. Tried to make a play, stolen right away from him by Clifton, and rocketed back in. And on the outside, Chris coming, he drilled Clifton from behind. Oh, they battle for it, and it comes back out to center. He regains his goal stick. Not a shot on goal yet. Walk back in. McAvoy, a shot, he scores! Stick, and then he's jolted a bit there by O'Reilly, but now it's Coyle moving along. Here's Coyle pivoting, slung one in front, directed right on goal, and a save made by Bennington. I guess the rust thing's out the window now. Got a lot of rust out here now for the Bruins. Knocked away from his stick from behind. Jammed on as far as Bergeron, connects on to Marchand, able to step by. Marchand able to move along, twists and stop one that was stopped by Bennington. What an effort by both the shooter and the goaltender to be in position to make that stop. Great release there by Marchand right off the bar, as you mentioned, Doc. Brought back ahead now, and here's Poster knocked around in front, puck checked away by Bennington, and he made another stop that time as Bergeron is there. Well, we're seeing a celebration of skill by the Boston Bruins here in the middle 20 minutes of this game one. Played on by Achari, and then Corrali wants to play the point. Chara flips one, then a shrug down off of Bennington, scrap for there, stays in front, Corrali Sean Corrali and the rip one inside the near post. And for the first time tonight, the Bruins have the lead. It's three to two. Look at them, the Lambo leap for Sean Corrali, who's got a flare for the dramatic. Fired for there, and the puck came back along in a nice pass by Schwartz onto the back. Played along by Petrangelo to Schwartz yet again. Puck thrown back to the front of the net. Meanwhile, around behind it's Krejci, holding on to it, got it to the slot, and a shot by McAvoy is deflected wide. This is Kirkin and a running leap into one of the first Thomas. No bucket, old time hockey. Tory Krug with a battle in front of the net with David Perron. Clean hit by Tory Krug. He came a long way. He wanted somebody. By one more shot, slipped one that's whacking just wide and can be forced along there by Perron. Then Pareko bounced high. Marshawn scores! Boston Bruins roar back with four unanswered goals, and they win game one of the Stanley Cup final by a final of four to two out of the St. Louis Blues. And the Boston Bruins, for the first time in years, win a Stanley Cup final opener on home ice. You have to go back to 1974 against the Philadelphia Flyers.